20 tips video for you guys. So I have eight tips for you guys to stay safe this Halloween, whether you're going to a college party, if it's a high school party, or pretty much any parties in general. This kind of is just kind of my tips and tricks on staying safe and having a great time because while Halloween is really fun, of course, anytime you go to a party with a lot of people, there's going to be some danger. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and give it a big thumbs up if you're excited. But yeah, this is also a huge collab with so many amazing girls. So I will leave all of their videos down below and I'll list all of their names on the screen so that you guys know who all is in this collab. It's so awesome. We are all doing different Halloween themed videos. There's Halloween costume ideas, there's story times, there's just so many fun videos for you guys to check out and so yeah again I'll have them all linked down below for you guys so make sure you go check them out and if you're new here from any of the other girls channels hi I'm Cicely you should go ahead and click that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on any of my videos I would love to have you a part of the fam without further ado I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get started so my first party tip is to always bring a friend and to never go alone whether you're a guy or a girl it's really important to just not really show up at a party alone especially if you don't know everyone that's gonna be there it's important to make sure that you are with someone that you trust so you can just look out for each other be each other's wingman or wing woman and just keep each other safe <laughs> since Liv's calling me hello do you want to happen to get ready together and go to Tom's house party later tonight yeah totally I'd love to go with you dude I never make you go alone hey I'm excited okay I'll see you, okay, in a little bit. I'll see you later okay. bye so my second party tip is to not be afraid to turn down alcohol. You don't need a drink or need to be drunk to have fun. That's just not true. So if it's not your thing or you're underage, it's definitely okay to say no. A little pro tip right here is that if you're at a party where they have a lot of mixers because they're making drinks, get a little bit of club soda or Sprite and put a lime in it and no one will tell you you're not drinking alcohol. I mean, that is if you're that concerned about it. Hey, sis, like, let's go find the bar. You know, I'm not really gonna drink tonight, but I'll totally go with you. My third party tip is to be open to meeting new people. You really never know who you can meet while you're out. You can meet a new boyfriend or you could potentially meet one of your new best friends. Hey, I'm Brad, what's your name? Hi, I'm Cicely, nice to meet you. So the fourth tip I have for you guys is to always bring your ID and either cash or a debit card. Whatever you feel more comfortable with, always make sure that you just have a little bit of money with you because you never know what emergency situation you could be in and if you either need cash or you just need something that you can get somewhere with if you're stranded anywhere. Again, it's just always smart to be prepared so that you are never left stranded anywhere. to remember that every guy is not out to drug you. I feel like there's a lot of stigma and stereotypes put with like frat parties or college parties and things like that. And honestly, yes, there are some people who are evil. It's definitely not every guy. And there are just some guys who might feel really awkward or shy, but then they built up the courage to talk to you and ask you to dance or ask you to just hang out and talk or, you know, just straight up just come up and start talking to you. It does take courage to do that. Just remember that you don't always have to feel the need to shut it down immediately. Hey, wanna dance? Me? Yeah, sure, why not? My sixth party tip that I have for you guys is if you're going to drink, do not take any drinks from anyone. I can't stress this enough, do not take any drinks that you have not poured yourself, did not watch someone pour the entire thing and hand it to you because that's just honestly just like common sense of safety. It's an ideal situation for someone to do this to you because there is a lot of people and a lot going on and it's really easy to not pay attention but I can't stress how important it is to really pay attention if you're drinking, where your drinks are coming from, who's pouring them, um, where you're getting them, if they were closed before you got them and things like that because drugging does happen and it is important to just be aware. Hey pretty lady, would you like me to get you a drink? It's okay, I'm good but Thanks anyways. My seventh party tip is to go all out with your costume. Trust me, everyone does it. Especially in college, and I mean togas and all. It's really fun, and also your costume or someone else's costume could totally be a conversation starter if you're talking to a guy that you're totally crushing on. Post up, run around in it, blossom on it. The diamond, my diamond, there's a rock, my rock. I will 
woke up like this. I woke up like this. We flawless. And my eighth party tip that I have for you guys is to not give your number out like it's water. If you're a guy or a girl, this is important to be very selective with who you give your personal information to. And it's totally okay to turn someone down, but just do it politely so it's not like too awkward of a situation. If saying no doesn't work and they keep pressuring you to give them your number, ask them for their number instead and tell them that you'll text them. Hey, yo, girl, can I get the digits? Can I get your number? Why don't you just give me your number and I'll text you later. I already have my phone out, so here. You're right, I'll give you my number. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Again, if you're new here, hi, I'm Cicely. You should go ahead and click the subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on any of my videos. And if you guys haven't already, make sure you go check out all of the other girls' Halloween inspired videos. Again, I'll have them linked all down below. So make sure you go check them out, subscribe, watch, like. They're awesome, and I know you guys are all gonna love their videos. So, again, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.